I've let my plunge pool rewild. It started out as an unpromising patch of ground, but after plenty of digging and dreaming and lots of heaving, we made a small organic pool. But introducing fish as an experiment has led to problems. So we put a pike in the plunge pool, but is it just the alliteration that's criminal? Hello, I just thought I'd give you an update to what's been happening with the small pike that my son caught uh, being introduced into the plunge pool. Well, it was something rather unexpected turned up about, uh, about a week ago. It was a bailiff from the Environment Agency. Apparently, um, somebody had reported me, some public spirited person, had reported that I had been restocking fish without the relevant license from the government. Now, I said um, what any um, honourable parent would do, that it was nothing to do with me, is my son, he's totally out of control. I, I've got, you know, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with him. Um, but, um, uh, no, actually I didn't. Uh, I showed this uh, gentleman around. He was actually really quite a nice bloke. And uh, explained the situation, and he said, it's perfectly fine. You can take any fish from the river, any, uh, this is in the UK, any fish, up to 65 centimeters long and do what it do with it what you will kill it eat it stuff it hang on the wall whatever now um, <clears throat> what you can't do is uh, move it from one part of the river to another part of the river because that will transmit disease potentially but you're perfectly fine putting it in your own pond because it's not connected to the rest of uh, the environmental waterways. So, in this situation, there's nothing to worry about at all. Um, so, and actually, he turns out to be a really nice bloke, and he's really into pike fishing, so my son is very keen to talk to him, and he was very interested in the organic pools. I showed him around. So, um, hopefully, actually, uh, we'll get to see him again, because, uh, as I say, he is a really nice bloke. Anyway, the, the pond itself is, um, there's nothing that much to report uh, other than the water's still murky, it's winter and um, when you get warm days like this, you do get you know, clumps of algae growing, you will do anyway. The vegetation is rotting down, a lot of nutrients in the water. Uh, I don't really expect to see any change in the situation until the spring uh, when plants start growing. So we'll see what happens, whether the pike does eat the stickleback, which then allows the Daphne to flourish and keep the water clear. So at the moment, the water's looking pretty murky. It's pretty cold, not many degrees above uh, zero at the moment, uh, but we've still got plenty of algae. So in terms of the pond, not much to report, but you never know. It's all very exciting when you put a pike in a plunge pool. <laughs>